the email is kind of a smoking gun. Taste of Belgium owner Jean-Francois Fleche was disappointed when Cincinnati Financial Corp refused to pay damages when his restaurants were shut down by the pandemic. We pay a lot of money for insurance to, to be covered for things like that. But he was even more disappointed when he learned some of its executives thought damages should be paid. It's not surprising that privately they're saying that there should be coverage. Are they going to say publicly, I doubt it. Uh, but I mean, now we have the emails. This email could be a problem for Cincinnati Financial because it undercuts what it's been telling its policyholders for nearly two years. They can't collect on business interruption coverage because COVID-19 doesn't cause property damage. Cincinnati Financial wouldn't talk to us about the email in which a management employee wrote, once someone who is a carrier is on our premises, that constitutes some type of property damage. This email is a clear admission from Cincinnati Insurance Company that its policies do in fact provide coverage for COVID-related shutdowns. Attorney Gagan Gupta is suing Cincinnati Financial in North Carolina. The Cincinnati and other insurance companies have worked very hard to keep these kinds of internal discussions and communications from getting out into the public. Attorneys for the Prima Vista restaurant in Price Hill asked the Supreme Court to consider the email as evidence at today's hearing. That was rejected on procedural grounds. The case is now under advisement. It's not clear when the court will rule. Dan Monk, WCPO 9, 